What's up guys and girls, it's EP with Styles of Life. Got another unboxing video for you guys, another electric skateboard for that matter. Not the boosted board because I already did a video on that, but I'm going to do a comparison video soon. That's the next thing I got to do, but I got to open this up first. This is the Meepo board for those of you guys that don't know. It's made by this guy that's super passionate about his product. He builds electric skateboards and then... I found out about it through the subreddit, Electric Skateboard subreddit, so shout out to that subreddit. And it's by this guy named Kyran, K-I-E-R-A-N. And he makes these boards, but I think I'm gonna return them because if you guys know about my experience on the last board, the Nuff board with the in-hub motors, I do not have good experience with it. But everyone online is saying they're having amazing experience with the the in-hub motors, the ones that's in the wheels, and they don't have that problem where the trucks snap on them. I haven't seen any videos, anyone post anything about it yet, but it happened to me within an hour, so like I'm kind of traumatized, so I might return this. But it's so so cheap, guys. Like this was like 250 plus shipping, which was like 100 bucks. Um, so it ended up being like 350 shipped. But enough talking, enough enough talking. Let's get to the unboxing, guys. All right, so it comes in a, like a pretty ghetto package. Well, not ghetto, but it's like, it like taped up the box. It's not like super nice and fancy like the boosted board where it's like layered up in like three boxes. It's like got a bunch of tape right here. So I gotta be careful or not. Yo, yo, this, this board, look at this. I, I just cut it open, right? And then right when I open it, it's just bam, board, ready to go. That meeple fucking, that meeple word is so big, guys. Oh man, it came ready to go though, it's just like. Oh, I like the black wheels actually, it's kind of heavy. Um, I think it's lighter than, oh dang, it just turned on. It's got half battery life right now. All right guys, so far, looks kind of cool. It's got the handle, which is nice. Um, but I'm used to holding the boosted board already now. It's not too heavy. And then inside the box is another box, as always, and I'm sure this has all the remotes. Oh, I'm sure you guys are curious to what the remote looks like. All right, so inside the box, it's got like some LEDs. Is that's a good deal? It's got a hook. Oh, you can put a wall on the, a wall hook to store your board. I'm assuming that's cool. That's paying for buck. It's got the skate tools, of course, and then it's got the remote which isn't the same as the booster board. It's a smaller one, but let, let me see if you guys can get a good idea <sighs> what it looks like. There we go. It's got the lever right there, back and forth, strap, on and off, mode settings. Cool. What's in this box? I'm sweating so much, guys. Every time I record a video, every, look at this. I just showered and I feel like I gotta go shower again. But every time I record a video, I gotta turn off the AC and it's, it's summer right now. And like, I sweat a lot, guys. I really do. But there's nothing wrong with that, right, guys? We all have our insecurities. It's all about being confident, guys. This is the charger. Haha. <laughs> all right, guys. I'm gonna get this charged up. I'm gonna do test runs, gonna run with it for like a couple days and then alternate between this and the boosted board. And then I'll come back with a comparison video and give my thoughts and see if I actually return this or not. Stay tuned, guys. Bye. 